Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Within. With me, Get Daved. Uh, let's just go straight back to the scanning. Um, I don't have any Exalt LMGs. Somehow they went missing. But there's a decent chance we could come across some. Also, I seem to recall thinking the Exalt base was in France. To make the gallop chamber. If I make some money, we can do a sweep. Yeah, I need to be sure. Commander, our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Uh, interesting. I have all of Europe. Lower panic in Argentina now at full value. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum. Capacity. Oh, never mind. Additional uplink required. I thought I was going to sneak one more in. Oh well. We did get money in the form of a rebate. What am I thinking? Can we? Okay, we can't perform again. Back and forth we go. The adrenaline spike caused by killing an enemy can now be channeled into a hormone cloud, making it contagious. Boy, imagine if a chrysalid turns them into a zombie now. Ah yes, bloodlust. Always good for your soldiers. To the temporal lobe will cause massive brainwave spikes, damaging any psionic attackers. Also known as what goes around comes around. Incoming transmission. Excellent. Here's Commander. money. This council is pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. Pretty cool. A lot of money. We will be in touch, Commander. Once the Nexus is up, we'll be good to go. Uh, first things first. Do the scan. Intel scan complete. Positive ID on Exalt cell locations. All right. Where's Rube? Oh man, it'd be pretty cool to send Vandal in, actually. She would kill everyone. Oh. Man, he was gravely wounded. Okay, um... I thought you were pretty cool. Psychic power is also a pretty good bonus, um, because they have an alternative to the pistol. You do not get a med kit. I've learned things. The latest contact turned Go out to get him. Dead. Probably just another drunk pilot who fell asleep on a long haul. Oh, well, I'm good drunk truckers. <laughs> drunk air truckers are uh, very common. In my day, pilots were hopped up on go pills, and we liked it that way. Uh, we could hold out on the satellite launching, but you know what, let's just go for it. The theme of this video has been going back and forth to the Situation Room screen. Yay! Free instant autopsies. And we'll launch India as well. Satellite launched. Um... I guess there might be a slight benefit to holding off on launching the other two. So let's wait on that. Things are heating up out there. We're tracking multiple unidentified targets. It's not even true. That's just flavor text and you know it. By incorporating melt into skin pigment, you. we've been able to create a chameleon like effect for our soldiers. They turned the color of the gross jean tanks. Alright, let's go. Let's get a text message. I gotta stop putting my phone there. Excellent. We look forward 
forward to seeing your progress. Um. Yeah, Vandal, I think we're gonna bring you this time. I'm gonna call you the insurance policy. There we go. Just to be sure. Let's do a quick check here. One kill per mission, two on the next soldier. Although he's gotten a lot of help. And two, yeah, Vandal's just objectively a killing machine, averaging almost three kills per mission. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, yeah, I feel good. It's gonna be okay, we've got Vandal. Also, this is pretty exciting. Prepare for landing. If we succeed... Scans indicate an exalt cell currently operating in Australia. We'll need to secure the area while our operative focuses on the exalt data. If we succeed, we'll be able to probably find the exalt headquarters unless we get really useless intel. It's not in a country, not in this game. in position to transmit the data they'd acquired when exalt forces moved into their AO. The encoder is currently shielding our transmitter's position, but if Exalt manages what a to safe the location. Encoder, they'll be able to locate the transmitter. If they had both, any hope we had of recovering the data intact will be lost. Well, uh... Um, Objective updated. I thought I'd put the jamming laptop on the patio because of, you know, the view. If we don't take to time to enjoy the little things, we're no better than the aliens. Uh, I'm gonna take her turn last. Because I currently don't know how to get up there. Alright. Roger, tracking. Uh, Vandal can take a ton of punishment. You get the honor of going in first. If that were possible, which it is not. That's affirmative. Man, what to do with the sniper? Good candidate, candidate for uh, Jedi modification. For jumpiness, though. I don't know if I feel safe running that way. Got some useful perspective on things, though. So we can go through the wall or out the door to get to the trans or the encoder area. All right, fine. Don't see a Tin Man finding like a mobility-based way of uh, getting to the top. Punch our way through the door. That's extremely helpful. Man, it's a really stupid thing to do with the last action, but I'm kind of tempted to see. Oh man. I kind of want to know what's in the door. We'll put her there and maybe open it next turn as a first action. Got 
to equip that plasma rifle. I really should have done that. Hmm. Bunch of jammers back here. All right, operative, congratulations. Okay. Got yourself a fully escorted trip back here. Oh, great. Which is now an extremely dangerous place. Heading out. Good chance we could detect a lot more enemies, so I'm gonna open up with a run and gun here. Um, as I've gotten more experienced at the game, I've been less into the strategy of using run and gun to then run into a hot zone, like I just did. Because she's actually in a super terrible spot. Sixty-two percent. It's basically a point four of missing. Eighty-six percent chance of hitting. All right. Can sniper help out at all? just isn't a great line of sight situation. Kind of tempted to run for a location like that so we could snipe people who get to the hackery zone. Man, squad sight's doing nothing for him. Seeing as it's exalt and all, I wonder if we can blow up a transmitter. Let's find out. Decisions. Okay. Take the super safe location. Can't even see them. That's pretty lame. Position confirmed. All right, we can just hit the car. I hope it explodes. Incoming. There we go. And this is our last action. And then Vandal is gonna be totally exposed. So let's see what we can do. Not really any super safe locations left. Okay, then given those options, I'd rather move this way. Decisions, decisions. 59% flip a coin. 
That's all right. They won't want to stay there now. Make it count, Santiago. It's all right. That was a super long shot, literally and figuratively. Always nice, nice when those two line up. Don't have the one that lets you shoot too. Okay. Man, that sniper rifle looks cool when they shoot it. Dang. Well, some missions I get away with my carelessness, other times not so much. That's okay, we'll kill all of them. So when he was standing there, he could use his sight. Yeah, whatever. In the right situation, he'll get all of the action in the world, so... If we could set them both on fire, that'd be pretty cool. I think they might be too covered. Oh no, they... Really? And he just showed up. That's kind of hilarious, actually. He's been around for one second, and he's already on fire. That's what you get when you mess with XCOM. Nice opportunity to pad her stats. Kind of wondering who she's going to see on this run. Just the one. I'm just going to go for it. He's panicked. Hello. Okay, we should be good. I probably should have gone for the double shot, but I got away with what was like the most likely outcome, but I kind of view that as still... Uh, you have to assume things won't go remotely, <laughs> remotely well in this game. At least that's what I think. Flanking always gives you a nice critical bonus, though. I wonder if we're going to get a chance at that overwatch. Pew pew! Someone is attempting to access the encoder, Commander. Yeah, but we're going to kill him. That equipment, or they're going to locate the transmitter. Oh, you're going to regret that. Oh no! Smoke grenade? Okay, I thought it was gonna be worse. That's still super inconvenient. But, I thought it was gonna be worse. Alright, I'm gonna end this one here, and the next one, 
We're gonna mop up, and then maybe maybe we can start the process of going after the Exalt base. That'd be super cool. 